I've got some mailbag stuff, let's see what I've got this time. These three boxes from a new supplier. Looks very promising because they've got it very fast. We'll see what else we've got in here. I know one of these is going to be very interesting for some people. So let's start with these. Now I purchased this all from one order but they've uh, sent it as three separate packages. Which I'm really surprised about because I thought it would actually cost them a lot more. This is from Arrow. Never used Arrow before, it got recommended to me. Can't say it. Recommended to me the other day when I was doing my live stream. It says must you would be over. Really? <laughs> hmm. Well, it's well packaged. I'll get that much. Well packaged. Okay. Okay, it's out of the bag. This is. You are kidding me. Alright. So, big box. That's what's in it. <laughs> I thought I'd taken packaging to the extreme. A couple of capacitors. Now I've got these for my TV, which has been playing up. I did some video on that already. I probably haven't published it yet, I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll find out. If you haven't seen a video about me fixing my TV, then there is one coming. And um, these caps are needed for it. Well, one of them is. One's a spare. So, yeah. But all that packaging for two capacitors, that's a bit ridiculous. But it was very quick. So this came from Arrow. I'm not advertising or anything, but this is the first time I've used them. And I say it's recommended on uh, my live streams. So I've got two more from the same one, so we'll just group these together. And uh, they're an international company, but it seems that this is all shipped from the US. And it arrived in basically less than a week. So it's actually really good. Right, so we've got some more packaging here. Wow. Um, same deal again. This time for four capacitors, I think. No, five capacitors. There we go. Five caps. <laughs> um, so, two big packages to give me so far. A total of seven capacitors. Well, this is efficient, isn't it? I don't know how much money they made in this, but seeing as the actual order didn't come to that much, I don't know, it was about 30 bucks or something US, I think the whole order came to. I mean, the postage on these three items would cost more than that, wouldn't it? Hey, they've got good packaging. I mean, packaging's very good. And it's all recyclable, which I also like. Alright. Let's well, got a few more things. I'll, I'm going to open these bags. I've just got my dress on them. So I'll open these up and I'll come back. All right, I'll get on a, on a bench here. All right, so yeah, it's got these two bags. This one's more substantial. This is what you expect to be in the box. You know, like, that's perfectly fine, but this one's not too bad. So <laughs> the other one's a bit ridiculous, aren't they? All right, so this is more like it. Now, what we've got here? More caps. There's five in there. Oh, these 63 volt. 100 mic, 1000 microfarad, 63 volt. Let's just look at the caps, it might be easier. These are. <laughs> I say as I can't see what these ones say. Uh, 22 microfarad, 100 volt. Oh, it's all just caps, right? They're not going to be interesting each individual one, are you? Surely not. They're all just caps. Lots of capacitors. Now these are just what I need for my TV. I need some, you know, quite high voltage caps to fix that. I'm going to switch my power supply. And I didn't have quite the right ones. I had some, but they weren't like OE, low ESR and stuff like that. So I need low ESR caps. Um, I tried to replace them with standard caps. And it seems to be working. It hasn't made it any worse. But there's some caps I couldn't replace. I don't the right ones. Including these ones here. And these ones here. So, yeah. That's a lot of caps. So, yeah, Arrow. I'm impressed. It's very fast. Price was reasonable, especially considering it came in three packages. Um, yeah, it's good. It's a, I think that's probably that's beaten um, RS and Element 14, you know, Farnell, um, as far as speed 
and I think price as well actually, I think the price is cheaper too at Wood Towers. Um, so yeah, well worth looking at Arrow, I recommend it, definitely. Mmm, good stuff. Right, see what's in this one. Okay, a whole bunch of header pins, or header jumpers. Uh, oh, I'm not focused. That's not going to help, is it? So got these ones here, which have got like a tile on them. Now I'll try and show you one like that. In focus, preferably. All right, so this goes into onto header pins, like a male header. And you've got other ones in here as well, different basic colours, a few different colours. I didn't, I actually had like two left, which I pulled from old hard drives years ago. I was like, oh, I'd better get some, so, uh, you know, as, I, as usual, I kind of got a bit carried away. Yeah, it happens. See what's in here. Thanks to my supporters, and everyone that uh, shares the video comments, that sort of stuff. Any kind of activity on the, on the videos uh, help me quite a lot, you know. Commenting on videos helps to make it seem more popular to YouTube, giving it a thumbs up, sharing it, especially because other people didn't get to see it. And there's some more. There's some uh, just different colour, same as the black ones, but different colour. Yeah, all good. So yeah, definitely uh, helps the channel. Now my eyes right now on 10,000 subs. It's coming close. 10,000. So if you're not subscribed yet and you're into electronics, make sure you subscribe because I really want to get to that 10,000 sub goal. That gives me some extra options and extra features on YouTube, which would be brilliant to get. Okay. This. Oh, yes. Now, let's check the package in case my name's all over it or something. That's looking good. Now these are from some which actually popped into one of my live streams and uh, had a chat. CMI Zapper. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. TRCS? TRCS? I, I, I don't know how you pronounce that. Um, this is 15 inch and that's 17 inch. Now these are for MacBooks. Uh, specifically the 2011 MacBooks which have issues with GPU failures. No one of the workarounds for that is to actually bypass the GPU and, and uh, you can do it through a firmware hack. But it doesn't stick. If you do a, a memory reset, it loses it. So non non-volatile RAM or PRAM reset, it will lose it. So if you have a look at read of that. And this is a little board which goes in there, which basically disables it in, in the ROM. Or in the firmware. Is it EFI ROM? And um, permanently disables it. So if you do a reset it doesn't matter. And this is the other one. So 17 inch, 15 inch one. So I've got a 17 inch which has got a dead GPU. In fact I even took the GPU off the board and it's sitting underneath my desk here waiting for me to get back to it. So this would be a good try on that one because it doesn't have a GPU in it now. So I could put this in and see if it works. And then we've got this one here. I've got a machine which has got a intermittent GPU. It works most of the time okay. Other times it just craps out. Um, once I figure out which computer it is, because I've got a couple of them which I kind of use for other things, once I figure out which one it is, I'll, I'll put this in it and see how we go with that. So, yeah, that's brilliant. So, I'll be doing reviews on these. Pop of reviews, these have been sent to me for review, I suppose, for free. Um, but I'll be putting some links down as well for where you can get these. Because if you're into MacBook stuff and you're trying to do these repairs, these are unusual, they're not well known about. I didn't know about this particular modification until this guy popped into the chat and, and um, let me know about them. And so he sent me a couple of them. So yeah, I'll put links down below for the website and that sort of stuff. And I'll do full reviews on these as well once I actually go to do it. I'll do a review. I'll, put, I'll fit them and give them a go. So, but yeah, this is like the EFI ROM hack, but it's a permanent. You don't lose it. And it's better than doing any hardware mods to the GPU. Well worth looking at. Don't forget to share it, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, click the bell icon, give us a thumbs up, and uh, have a chat down below in the comments, especially if you want to talk about these things. Or any other things over here, but I imagine it's mostly going to be with this. Maybe tell Lewis. Lewis Rossman might be interested in these too. 
maybe you want to tell Lewis that I've got them. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Catch you later.